guys. Oh. Yeah, we're back. Okay, guys, we're back. Oh, and, and you get, say, yeah. Make sure you have your parents' permission and make sure you're using a plastic knife. Okay? Oh, and I'm using a plastic spoon right now, but you can use any kind. Oh, and make sure to use these electric candles that don't need any that are they electric or they have a battery david they do have a battery see? okay yeah so oh. these candles use these ones these are right there and of course your apple so i'm gonna carve it out first you starting at the top Okay, David, could you turn around to the other side so that that way we can uh, see you and what you're doing yeah, better? That's right. Thank you. Okay. So you're taking the stem part out of the, the apple? Is that because the apple's juicy, or why is it messy? Yeah, yeah. There's a lot of apple juice. Juice. Mm -hmm. Digging out the, where the stem of the apple was, huh? Mm -hmm. Now, what do you call this again, David? An apple lantern. An apple so lantern. As you see, guys, I dug out the stem of this apple, and this is what it looks like so far. Remember, remember, remember. Saying this again in the video, use a plastic knife. Oh, and get your parents' permission first. So it depends on how hard the apple is, on how hard it is to get the, the, the inside. The thing is, it was hard because I hit the seeds. Oh, okay. Uh huh. So, this seems good enough. Okay. Here's a good look. It, it, yeah. Okay, yeah, the inside, okay. So, then, what you do is you out 
this is what comes out. Uh huh. Of the straw. And this is how it looks so far. Mm -hmm. So then, for the other eye, you, of course, do the same, but on the other. But next to the other one. like a little apple piece of paper, a little piece of paper made of apple. Mm -hmm. but, yeah. Now this is what it looks like. With the two eyes, uh-huh. Yeah. So we've got the top and the two eyes, oh yeah. And I'm quick on poking other parts. Oh, so it would be perfect. Make sure that you can perfectly see through the eyes. So you have to look through them first to make sure. And then, of course, we have to carve out the uh, mouth here. And then you, you did, I did. You pretty much do poke the spoon into it one part on top of the other. Then you take a knife, your plastic knife, because it has to be plastic. Don't play with knives. Don't play with sharp, sharp ones at least. And then. Well, it certainly is turning into a, a face now. Okay, so this is what it looks like without the light in it. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. It's completely done. Now it's an apple pumpkin thing. So now, when you take this light and take a light like this one and switch it on, it will look like this. Then you take your apple lantern and put the light in. Oh, yeah. But if you want it to stay in better. Oh, and actually, last time I made one of these, it didn't stay together as well because it was in multiple, multiple pieces. Could you move to the side, David, so I can see what you're doing? Yeah. I am carving out a bit of the top because it has just if you want it to stay in better you carve up the top like this and stick it in there like that so it's much easier and oh, there you made it you the go. same size I see oh isn't it cute Oh, yeah. And it looks like he has a little white hat on. It does look like he so has a white hat. So that's how to make a apple lantern. And, of course, what? if you look, I carved out this. And there. Very nice. It looks pretty good. does look pretty good. It certainly does. And this is what came out of it. Yeah, not a lot. doesn't look like a lot came out of it. Just, just your expertise on, on carving it out and making this it. This is the first time I made it without having it in in multiple pieces mm -hmm. of, and put together. Just, yeah. Because my old one is pretty bad and this one is pretty good. Okay, yeah. now you take a picture after the video to do it. Okay. okay. All right.
We want to take a, a picture? Uh-huh. Okay, that's all for today. On day.